Hi there, YouTubers. Pat Prepper here. Today I'm going to show you how to use a couple of different kinds of brushes. Um, this right here is a double-coated dog, and it's a long-haired double-coated dog. This is a slicker brush, and what the slicker brush does is it breaks apart the mats and it gets out a lot of the undercoat. Now, what you're going to want to do to start with this with this type of a coat is you're going to want to brush through and get as much of the undercoat and tangled out as you can with this brush. And your goal is to be able to get through with a comb or an undercoat rake all the way down to the skin without without catching any mats and feeling hesitation. So if you are brushing and you catch a mat like this, you have to brush again. If you can get all the way down to the skin and pull the comb through without hesitation, you're good to go. So, now if you run into an area that is too matted and the slicker brush isn't going to work, uh, this is another tool that you can use and this is called a mat splitter. On the inside here, it's razor blades. That's not the side that's going to touch the dog's skin so you don't need to worry. But what this will do is it'll break apart the mat. So, I always like to work in layers and I always like to start down low and work my way up. So I'm going to just jump up here to an area that's pretty matted so I can show you how to use the mat splitter. You just gently, as gentle as you can, go through and either saw the mat through and break it apart or you can sort of chop at it like this. This is a real nervous dog. Um, that's why he's panting. <laughs> he always does. He's fine though. Um, and then what you want to do is get a little area picked through, broken apart, and go through with the slicker brush and get out what you just worked out. Okay, and you just repeat that until you can get all the way down to the skin. And what I kind of do um, when I'm looking at a dog and thinking, oh my gosh, I'm never going to get done with this, you just kind of visually cut the dog into quarters. And you work in that one area and finish that and then work in the other area and then, you know, until you're all the way completely through the dog. So those are three of the tools that um, I kind of wanted to show you today. Pat Prepper.